we had done this this trial with uh, with IL seven previously, and and we saw some some clinical um, effects. Um, the unfortunately the um, the overall survival was not uh, was not significantly different, although the study was not powered to look at at overall survival. Um, but we think we saw something clinically. Um, our data suggests that comparatively IL-15 is going to be a much better cytokine compared to IL-7 in combination with CYP-T. And, you know, there are a number of IL-15 um, immunocytokines or super agonists or, um, you know, uh, fusion proteins that are in development. Um, and so what we're doing now is exploring the combination of of some of these ones that are in clinical development um, with the hope of um, doing essentially a, a kind of a, a repeat trial. instead of IL-7, we'll use one of these IL-15 super agonists in combination with CYP-T. Um, you know, initially we'll have to evaluate the, the safety and tolerability of the combination um, although CYP-T on its own is extremely well tolerated, um, and given our results with IL-7, we don't anticipate um, any large amount of toxicity. Um, and then really, um, you know, doing a, a larger trial to look at the combination IL-15 superagonist and, and CYP-T versus CYP-T alone. Um, and, um, you know, that is hopefully going to supercharge um, CYP-T in these patients, get more of these uh, CYP-T activated tum uh, uh, cells into the tumors um, and uh, see if we can affect a, a more a clinically meaningful effect for these patients.